Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Elalber directly from Tijuana, Baja California. How are you? All right, so, well, this is the part two or kind of of the um, yesterday's video where I was telling you that um, they had invited me to the biggest place in town. And, well, um, briefly, I want to, uh, yes, talk about this, all right? I had some kind of not good experience right there in the bathroom, all right? Because uh, the the guy in the bathroom, he told me something totally um, not right, something totally incorrect, all right? Um, I tip him just a few coins, and he got mad at me, all right? So guys, do, don't be intimidated, never, all right? Tips are something that are optional, 100%. 100% optional, okay? So if you don't give tips to waiters, the guy in the bedroom, or anything like that, let me tell you a big secret, there's no problem, all right? So uh, supposedly um, the service will be a little bit better, okay but trust me i've been hanging out with guys uh, for many years already and sometimes we do not tip no one at all okay and we have i had a um yeah i always talk about my friend I ha and he's the same guy i have a friend all right that he always always gives the tip at the end of the night all right or the time that you spend right there Okay, he always tips the waiters later, all right? That's his uh, tactic, okay? Or actually sometimes he will uh, let know the waiter that uh, he will receive a tip later on the day. Why later? Because you sit in one uh, table. Well, not in the table, right? <laughs> but you know what I mean. All right, well, you sit right there, so he will be your waiter. So you will tip that guy at the end. All right, you will, uh, and that's because when you ask for um, something, a drink for you, a drink for the girl, sometimes these guys want a tip every time that they go to the um, front counter or the, uh, the bar, you know, every time. And that's something that, well, unless you, you, you don't mind giving like uh, a dollar every time, you tip the guy at the end, okay? As well, I mean, uh, we, we go again and touch the same subject, all right? Probably, who knows, a dollar, five dollars, twenty dollars is just chump, um, chump change for you, all right? Doesn't even count, okay? Probably, all right, uh, they are customers, national and international customers that they tip the waiters with big money why um i don't know <laughs> but they do all right there are guys who tip everyone at the club they tip the the uh, security guards all right they tip waiters they tip the bartender they tip everyone okay so we have to understand that uh most of us think that a tip is just something additional for the good service and optional I mean that's a fact it's optional but uh, there are some guys that they do give extremely high tips and I'm talking about to the uh, male workers of these particular places okay this is not the first time that I have uh, negative uh, well a negative as atmosphere of uh, the bedroom because I always tip Mexican coins and just a few of them okay and these guys um, that are working in the bedroom uh, my homie well my friend uh, now this is another friend that used to work in one of the big three clubs he passed away unfortunately all right, he told me that these guys that are selling things in the bedroom, that are cleaning the bedroom, that will hang out a the paper towel, okay, 
they are workers, meaning that they receive a salary, all right? I don't know if that has changed within the last few years, but that's what I was told. They do receive a salary, all right? So um, they don't buy the paper towel, all right? That's something that the uh, actual establishment or, or the business is the one that will buy all the items, all right? So do not feel intimidated for not giving a tip or just giving a little tip, all right? So if a waiter kind of uh, rejects <laughs> your coins, by the way, uh, US coins, they, um, they're worthless here, okay? Your um, US coins, your quarters, your dimes, your nickels, your pennies <laughs> have no worth here, right? They may accept that, especially, uh, probably the quarters, all right, but uh, try, don't, do not tip with coins, all right? The reason is because uh, like uh, seven years ago, Mexican banks, they have a very limit acceptance of dollar, all right? So the banks eliminated the coins. The banks, they don't accept the coins any longer. Uh, exchange places, as well, we'll, uh, they, they are special with the coins. You cannot go there and uh, exchange your coins for bills very easily. So do not tip with coins. If you wanna tip, okay, that will be a dollar. If uh, you believe a dollar is too much, if you're that kind of guy, like me, <laughs> um, or simply you don't have money, all right, but still you want to tip something, yes, tip. Uh, above of five pesos all right i'm talking about the bedroom to so the bedroom guy to your waiter come on let's try to give him a dollar maybe not every time but let's try to tip this guy just a few dollars for all his work okay all the work that he does for you because well you know he has to go all the way from your table to the bar tackle a lot of people all right they pooch people that's something that i hate they push people with no mercy <laughs> and they will um, bring your drink to your table safe, all right, totally um, safely. All right, so that's what I wanted to tell you about um, that, all right? Well, um, as if you watched the previous video, I was telling you that I had, um, I was surprised, all right, that I was invited at no charge and they, uh, actually i didn't pay for nothing at all and we went the next day okay uh, you know i was talking about this guy that came from another mexican state all the way here so yes i don't know how but he uh got money all right i am maybe um he did ask for someone to please uh, borrow some money and he uh, had money and still um I was kind of disappointed with this guy because even though he did a better job, this time uh, he has touched all the girls, all right, but he didn't go upstairs. Well, uh, he's married, so you know, there are these guys that uh, they're faithful kind of <laughs> because he went with a girl to uh, the previous night, he went upstairs. Okay, so well, um, again, I enjoy in the good sense of the um, term, I enjoy seeing, uh, to see these faces, all right? Because I don't know, it's like uh, a brotherhood, all right? Something that we all feel the same, in the same way, right? Uh, those uh, expressions in his face, those eyes, it makes me feel like I'm, I'm part of something. <laughs> all right, guys, well, this uh, was the video for today, okay? Um, and now that we're talking about tips, your tips are welcome here. I will have to bring uh, to this channel or I have to make another video uh, talking about tips in Mexico. Here in Mexico, we, all right, let me put it this way. We don't ask for tips or people in general, they don't ask for tips every time, okay? Uh, here in Mexico, a lot of people like to tip, all right, for, uh, probably uh, services minimum all right probably gas minimum thanks like gas stations uh, I don't know uh, the parking lots 
all right the uh people that will um act well are uh, they they're not used any longer but are uh, the people that will put your groceries in the back for you all right they were eliminated not too long ago all right but here in mexico we like to tip and we know that just a small a few a few coins will make the difference for a family okay sometimes uh, the guys who uh, receive the tips for example a worker in the uh, parking lot with the, those coins that he will receive every day he will put put in the table all right so uh, tips it's something that uh, no one has the last word about it all right but the only good thing are tips are 100 percent optional uh, they are uh, restaurants fancy classy uh, buffets or restaurants that the tip will be added in the bill right in the check on the ticket whatever you want to call it all right so it will be uh, what you had consumed everything right there will be all right and it one thing will we'll say tip all right under no circumstance they can force you to pay that part of of the ticket all right it's still optional even though it's a ticket it's optional they cannot call the police because you're not you refuse to pay the tip but do the other things that i believe just pay like the 25 percent but not of the ticket of that particular tip all right or just give something all right for example um and i'm talking about of hundreds of pesos all right i'm because we're, remember we're talking about fancy places it says that the tip i don't know it's uh let's say twelve dollars give three give four or if they give you extremely uh, good service just give the full tip again there are customers that they will give more than the uh, minimum of the actual tip all right i would like to make another video about tips all right and i will try to uh, get more uh details all right this is something on our, on our culture i understand in the u.s the only people that get tips are the waiters i don't know probably there's another activity uh, that involves tips okay but um let's see all right in the next uh weeks i will try to get to get together information so we can talk about this all right probably uh, i will be not well not probably will not be focused on zona norte not even tijuana this will be like the uh, tip culture in mexico okay so that's something that i believe it will be good because you should not be offended if uh they ask you uh for tips but still you shouldn't you shouldn't feel bad if you don't give any tip all right guys <laughs> all right i hope i didn't confuse you with all this all right but still have fun dj it's what